Fast, accurate, and every day. First Defense Weather. Well, a happy Monday to you, and it was a breezy Sunday out there. 24 miles per hour was the peak wind gust at the Jamestown Airport yesterday. Definitely not as breezy as it was on, on Saturday. Definitely was windy along with a few rain showers that time they came down. Now, over the next five days, if you've got any yard work to do, today's going to be a great day, but don't forget the sunscreen. UV index really high today. Tomorrow, I'm giving you a caution light simply because late day showers and thunderstorms may arrive later in the afternoon. So... The morning and early afternoon will be fine. Later in the day might get a little more dicey. A green light back on Wednesday. Absolutely no on Thursday. Widespread rain showers and maybe a few thunderstorms. Then we're back to green as we go into Friday. And uh, tonight we may have a shot of seeing the uh, ISS tonight at 1034 p.m. It'll enter our uh, it'll enter our sky view from the northwest and move east north and move east northeast. It'll be visible for three minutes in the sky. So the best place to see it tonight is going to be away from city lights out in the country and if you get a shot of the ISS send it to us hunters WX on Twitter the first defense weather page on Facebook and you can email us you can send your pictures a whole bunch of ways to us we're very versatile here we've got many ways of communication so here we go with future scan noticing nothing through the day today basically sunshine across the area today the best chance for a rain shower is going to be northward near the Buffalo metro area I think is where the better chance of rain will be today just clear skies tonight great for that to ISS or stargazing tonight and then as we head into tomorrow notice how the model is trying to paint the, the rain further to the north. Do you think it'll be a little bit further south than where the model is painting it? But that's going to be later in the afternoon. So again, the morning and early afternoon will be fine. Later afternoon, maybe 3, 4, 5 o'clock may get a little bit more dicey. And then a few clouds start to roll in for tomorrow night. And then as we head into Wednesday, the sunshine will be back, but it still remains humid. The muggy air not going anywhere for at least the next few days. So gobs and gobs of sunshine for you today. Warmer, quite humid. The UV index again is at an 8. That's very high, so sunscreen recommended if you're going to be outdoors for any length of time. 80 to 86 today with that southwest wind, 7 to 14 miles per hour. Tonight, clear and starlit. River Valley fog redevelops. 56 in the deepest valley, 66 at the Lake Erie water with a west wind 4 to 9 miles per hour. Tomorrow, late day showers and thunderstorms, as we talked about, 3, 4, 5 o'clock will be the better chance for those. 79, but still humid. Got a pair of 7s for Wednesday, mainly dry, but still muggy. The weather really doesn't change until Thursday and Friday. That's out ahead of the cold front. So 73 on Thursday, but still muggy. Scattered showers and storms turns much cooler on Friday after that frontal passage, only around 70. The weekend, 50-50, 73 on Saturday, mainly dry, but only a few showers and thunder showers possible on Sunday.